Dr. Kevin Miller with Truth Family Chiropractic, and I'm here to tell you three tips on taking care of ear infections in your baby or young child. All right, so the first one is, is very obvious to me is chiropractic care. Uh, with the upper cervical area in the, in the neck, right below the skull, those nerves control some of the inner ear uh, muscles in there that when the fluid gets backed up in, into the ear, that just sits in there and those muscles spasm, so helping, helping that uh, fluid released back down to the eustachian tube so it can drain down the throat. So what we do, I have, my, I have my baby model right here and there's adjustments that we can do on the upper spine sometimes. It's easier just to hold the baby and we just use the tip of our finger and it's literally just adjustment like this. Um, even, even adjusting the thoracic spine just like that. Uh, sometimes, we can, sometimes we can lay the baby on, on their back just use the index finger and it's literally just a um, small small uh, thrust just like that into the C1 and C2 area. Um, sometimes you feel the baby, you'll hear a pop, sometimes you don't. And, uh, but very effective at getting that nervous system stimulated so it can release that pressure in the, in the ear. Uh, the second thing is, is mullein oil, garlic and mullein oil, all right, so this is uh, our trusty oil that when they do have an inflammation, what we do, we have an otoscope, we can check in the ear also to see if that uh, membrane, you know, if it's infected, if there's redness in there, uh, just to make sure that there's no, you know, there's, it hasn't burst or anything. Uh, we just take two drops of, of the mullein oil, open it up, we're gonna put it right in the, in the baby's ear and you let it uh, have the uh, baby or young child sit, lay on the side, uh, for five to ten minutes, let that get in there. It soothes that uh, tympanic membrane or the eardrum, and allows the allows that just that pain and the and the redness to decrease while while the ba baby and child is fighting the ear infection. And then the last one is a is a massage. So we're just going to lay the baby uh, on on the back, and there's a mastoid sinus down here that gets filled up with fluid. When there's an infection, I mean, the body, baby's body doing exactly what it's supposed to do by uh, using the sinuses, sometimes up here and, or the mastoid, but one thing you can do is, is just gently take that index finger and just massage that uh, mastoid sinus to allow, uh, push some of that fluid through and, and get that draining, get that sinus pre uh, pressure moving. So three tips that you can do to help with uh, ear infections for your child. Thank you.